another video and today I'll be talking about everything new in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 4 which is basically a Marvel themed season. So let's get right into it. So first of all I'm going to start off with the um, unvaulted weapons. I'll put a list of them up on the screen um, now. So we have loads of new um, weapons and vaulted weapons so the main ones are the pump is back, the pump shotgun, got unvault got vaulted in last season. And the combat, which was last season, season X, I think. I'm really excited about the combat, because it's one of my favourite, like, weapons. That, But it's, be, it's got a buff, so that's kind of a bit sad. But still, I really like the combat for the long range. It's like a long range shotgun. And I also like the pump, because... Obviously, when you're close range, you can do 220 to the head, but it might have a buff. Um, on screen, launch pads have been vaulted. This is, by the way, this is all gameplay from the last day of season three. So this is why it's not like I've got launch pads and all that. Um, so other stuff involved includes the epic shockwave grenades, not kits shockwave launcher. It's like the um. Shockwave grenades that were last seen in Season X. Also, bounce pads have been unvaulted. And also, um, trying to think. TAC SMGs have been unvaulted too. But they also have a buff, so Epic are going like no spray, no praying. Um, so let's go into some new items. So first, first of all, the first new items I've talked about is the new fish so there's loads of different fish like including the thermal fish where you can be it's but you've basically got thermal like night thing it's really actually weird and you've got like other fish that make you run faster low gravity fish that um a bit like hop rocks from chapter one season four which is also really good and you, now the fishing book has actually been added to the game and also a new fishing rod. The fishing book is basically, um, like it logs what you've caught in the game, like if you've got the mythic goldfish and all that. And um, a part of um, like you can a part of the fishing book, you can see what your friends have caught too, which is actually really good. And the advanced fishing rod deals a hundred damage. It could be a weapon, and you can upgrade this at upgrade benches. From a normal fishing rod to that, it's a hundred of every material to upgrade, and obviously that's got it gives you more chance of getting the mythic goldfish, which is like a one in five million chance. Another flopper worth noting is the Midas flopper. Basically, it's really rare to catch. Not as rare as the mythic goldfish, but if you catch it, turns your if you eat it, it turns your whole inventory in it in Fortnite to legendary rarity which is really good and um yeah so some unvaulted weapons include the decoys well the flare gun which i'm kind of sad about because it was really op the tack shotgun it's never actually been vaulted in the game before i really did like the tack but the buff made it just a bit harder to um play with and let's now talk about the battle pass so um, there's, the battle pass is basically our Marvel skins. So tier 1's 4, tier 22, which is different, like, to tier 20, like, from the rest of the season, is She-Hulk, but it's Jennifer Wal Walters. Am I saying that right? Correct me in the comments. Her, um, actual, um, skin name is Jennifer Walters, but there's been, like, some changes this season, so... You can do an emote in game to change them into like their real characters. Like for example, you've got Iron Man who is actually tier 100, which I thought 4 would be. You can change him into, from Tony Stark into Iron Man. You could change 4 from normal 4 to the God of Thunder. And you can change um, Mystique into like, I think it's all the skins that you've killed. It's really good. So I'll show... All the things that have been added to the files on the screen now. And so there are all the things that have been put in the files, like skins, all that. And there's going to be a say-so dance. How good is that? 
Fortnite are going with more TikTok dances. And it's really, really good. Like you've got Ren the Renegade and also Out West. So I can't actually play the dance because of copyrighted music. So okay. you probably know the dance anyway. So like, and also players should expect to get the ta ta Tycoon skin that was accessible by getting 10 points in the free Fortnite Cup. I've actually unlocked it. Well, I've not unlocked it because I've not played, but I unlocked it because I got 10 points from the um, cup, which is, it was really easy to get, to be honest. And, yeah, iOS users will not be able to play the new season as I think Ep Apple have banned um, the ability to uh, update Fortnite on the thing, so they'll be left riding the waves in season three, which is, I feel really sorry for them and I hope. We, this can get sorted out soon. New POIs include um, Doctor Doom's lab, basically from P Pleasant Park into it. Turn Pleasant Park into his lair. The authority has lost its walls, so it's basically the Agency 2.0. Um, and Sentinel's graveyard, which is um, another place um, that has been added. N near the authority on the hill near the authority and where the ruins are and tony stark has actually got some droids that he's programmed and if you knock them down you can actually program them to work for yourself which is actually a really cool feature and i rate it um no new mobility has been added this season sadly i was hoping for some like maybe planes could be added back or some but but like some that's like New or is like being voted like ballers or something like that. Definitely not the mech. <laughs> yep. And there's a new style for bullseye, the skin I'm wearing in the background. It's a textile, it's actually really good and free style for an eight hundred skin's actually really I rate it. So I'm lucky to have the skin to get the textile. And um there could be a Spider Man skin. I talked about in yesterday's video, it's not obviously in the battle pass. But this could be a Spider-Man skin because in one of the achievements you can unlock, it's got the Spider-Man logo, which is actually really good. And I really hope there is a skin. But if there is, that'll just be sad because I can't buy it. <laughs> I know. Like, I really hope Spider-Man was a battle pass skin, but no. So, one, like, there's new mythic weapons. Um, there's Doctor, Doctor Doom's got his own key card and he's also got, um... Two other mythic weapons, like repulses and this is superpowers basically, so yeah. And if you land at the Stark places, you can get a weapon from there too. As far as we know, there is no dragon shotgun yet, but that's wrapping it up for this video. Remember to like and subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching and goodbye.